Hey, Sunbeams. Happy Saturday. How was your weekend? How has everything been going for you guys? It has been a long ass weekend. Well, no, I take that back. Not a long ass weekend, but a long week. And I'm honestly so glad for the weekend. Like, I needed time. Okay. So this reading is... <laughs> this reading is for Cancer. Cancer, sorry for the long wait. Um... I don't know. Have y'all, if y'all have an iPhone 18, I mean, not 18. Sorry. If you have an iPhone, go ahead and do your update because the 18.1 is out. And I should have known when my phone started messing up and it wasn't allowing me to save videos. It was like every other thing. It kept saying no storage space, no storage space. It was because of the fact that my phone needed to be updated updated so <sighs> it's so tedious but whatever let's get to it cancer okay so the cards that you have unresolved issues and it's for the higher good so cancer you possibly have not fully closed the cycle um, with your past, whether it's um, lover, romantic, platonic, business, something you have not fully closed that door, and you need to go ahead and fix it. Okay, so let's go ahead and put some tarot to your energy to see exactly what's going on with you cancer and let's go let's take a deep dive okay holy spirit angels and guys what is the message for cancer you have the tower that's the first card that even popped out before i could even finish saying what i needed to say Okay. Dang, all my cards just fell. So you might be experiencing a tower moment with possibly your living situation or a family or a marriage situation. Okay? Well, sudden change. So maybe you might be going through a sudden change with your living or a marriage. If you are marriage, then... You also have the Five of Wands. So possibly a disagreement, maybe, like I said, with, well, Holy Spirit, who, who is Cancer having a disagreement with? What's the energy regarding? Possibly transitioning. So you're cut, removing the baggage. Maybe you're supposed to be moving. You, I think you're supposed to be moving, Cancer. Is your lease up? Or, I don't want to say it like that, but are you, are you going, are you having problems with your living situation? Because it seems like there has been some betrayal. The Seven of Swords, or somebody being very deceptive. Maybe where you're living, maybe in a marriage situation. But you have something moving very fast as far as maybe maybe a new home. Page of Cups. So you do have a little gift coming your way. I'm just dropping everything. I'm gonna need to get me a bigger desk. But you have the Page of Wands to come out, so. Possibly you might be actually getting ready to prepare for a trip. Maybe um, go on an adventure. You wanted some freedom. Um, you've been going through some tests. 
and it looks like you've been passing the test because it also looks as if you you've been going through some tests but it looks as if you've been passing like it's been some tests uh, in regarding in in relatance to temptation the fact that you have you see the angel taming the lion right maybe you have been taming your demons the fact that what if you you know have like maybe maybe sexual addictions maybe drug addictions um something that is part of your shadow side you've been taming it you've been learning how to be in the um the mind state of self-control kudos to you cancer you also have the king of swords so maybe someone wants to come over and make a, a head over heart decision and come in with some truth maybe this is um some people look at the king of swords as possibly a divorce man um yeah maybe a divorce maybe a i don't know it might not resonate for everybody but maybe someone who has been in a prior relationship with someone he wants to come and um state his truth to you but you're sitting in the nine of pentacles so of course you are single you're looking good oh shoot Not only are you looking good, but you got the sun card and you got the high priestess. So you're looking good. You're highly intuitive. The fact that you possibly may have been receiving downloads from spirit um, about some, not wishes, but more so like the fact that everything is aligning to your path and where like you're on divine timing you know it's positive now mind you i can tell you life be life in <laughs> i feel like that's a collective thing collectively everybody been going through some shit and i've been feeling it heavy and it's crazy because the three of swords came out so maybe uh the king of swords wants to tell you about something that they have done that possibly may have caused an ending or some heartbreak um some grief to you they want to come clean anything else holy spirit anything else anything else regarding cancer's reading Also, they want to share with you how they've been working hard, um, possibly staying focused on uh, their pinnacles. You have the page of pinnacles in reverse. So they've possibly been procrastinating. Um, maybe the lack of offering you a true commitment. But they want to offer you something. They're coming in as the Knight of Cups. They want to come to you in a creative manner, a charming manner, almost like the White Knights, you know, to come not, you know, to come sweep you off your feet. But they've been in hermit, hermit, hermit mode. But once they come out of hermit mode, because mind you, in hermit mode. They're soul seeking. They're trying to go ahead and seek clarity. And I think spirit is actually giving them that clarity to where they want to come to you as the King of Pentacles to offer emotional balance to you, Cancer. They will be taking a leap of faith. Let's go ahead and dive in on to what they want to say to you and also what spirit wants to say to you, okay? Okay, Cancer. So. The first card that came up is I'm ready for a commitment. I can't go another day without you. I'm scared you will reject me. And then for your love messages to yourself, redirect your thoughts. Focus on what you want to attract in this relationship, not on what you fear will happen. Patience. 
some things still need to be dealt with for this connection to manifest.